So I am about to take the dog to get her hair cut. So I take her to a grooming salon. Um, so I'll take you guys in the car with me and I'll show you what I picked up from Target. Which is this picture frame. It's just a timber frame. I think it was like $7 or something. Um, so I got that for my graduation photo. And it just sits on my messy bedside table like that. I've got some books and other stuff on here. If the camera would focus, there we go. Yeah, so I'm just going to have it sit here or on my other bedside table. So I'll see how that goes. So I just dropped off Lady at the groomers. She is getting, I think, what they call a teddy cut. So she maybe will look like a teddy bear. Um, that's pretty much it. I'm just going to go home and have some lunch and then I will pick her up whenever they send me a text. They said around 4 o'clock, so I'll vlog that. I hope the lighting's alright. I'm just in my bathroom at the moment. Maybe that'll take some of the echo away. So, I'm about to go do some groceries. Um, I'm just looking at my garden now. I might do a garden update later in the vlog. So, look out for that. Um, I'm also about to do my makeup. Just some quick five minute what I would do if I'm running to the store, which I am. Um, for my outfit, I've just got this brown t-shirt, some light blue jeans, Birkenstocks like normal. And I've got these new sunnies, which are kind of trendy, that I'm going to style as well. So I'm just going to do my makeup. Now, I've just started using this um, hyaluronic acid for, it's from The Ordinary. I've just started using this and you're meant to put it on before you put on your moisturizer and stuff. I also put it on before I put on my sunscreen. And as you can see, I've also started stretching my ears. So hopefully they turn out all right. And then I just put on this oil-free um, facial moisturizer in the morning. This is the one I use in the morning. It's got SPF 15 in it, which is not the greatest but at least it's something. And then I use this Kind and Free from Rimmel London um, concealer. I don't know what shade it is. It's 10 fair, but it's a bit light for me. I have another one, but I couldn't find it. Don't let me stay in front of the right side Looking at my life 
and then I just buff it out with a beauty blender. I don't know if you can see if it does much, but I'll turn this. It just kind of lightens up under my eyes. I'm, I am a tiny bit sunburned from when I went to the beach earlier in the week, which you would have seen in the last vlog, I think, or the start of this vlog. And I just have this kind and free um, from Rimmel London again. This powder. I don't know what shade it's in. Medium. 30 medium. And I just take the back of my beauty blender. Get some on there. And then just kind of do in the middle of my face. Like a contour or something. And then I have in the colour Driftwood this Nude by Nature eyeshadow. That's what it looks like. I just use a brush and I dab it a few times. And I just use like windshield wiper motions. And then I slowly get further and further out from in here. Like it goes in here first and then I slowly go further out. So I'm onto the eyebrows now. I just use a double-ended brush, one that has a one that has the angled end on it, and one that's got the spoolie. And I just go from ColourPop, go into the Ornate palette, and I get a little bit of Tipsy and a little bit of Dream. Tipsy is this brown color, and Dream is this shiny black color, and I just. Fill right in at the ends, and then whatever's left on the end of the brush, I work up my eyebrow. On the camera, it looks very dark. And then I just brush my brows upwards. I don't like them to be how everybody has them as fluffy brows but I do like them to look relatively natural. From far away it looks all right on the camera. And then I just go like this and press it down a little so they're not all standing up, but they're, you know, relatively all right. So that's my eyebrows. And then I just take an eyelash curler curl my eyelashes and then I have the hourglass caution extreme lash mascara 
and I just go in right on the ends of my lashes because I have very watery eyes and then if I put it right down the base and flick it out when my eyes water during the day my mascara gets in my eye and then my eye gets sore only right on the very ends. And then last thing, lipstick, which I don't normally wear. But I just gave a little bit of an outline and this is the color stay matte light crayon from Revlon and it is in clear the air so it's that color so that's just my everyday kind of 15 minute makeup I need to put on makeup but I don't want to put on foundation because it breaks me out. So that's what it'll look like. That's pretty much it. And most days I don't put on lipstick, but I thought I might as well today. So that's it for the minute, and I'll see you guys later. Oh, 
closer Don't let me stay if 